So the question I think people need to be asking is, will this end up being the sneaker of the year? I know that's a lot and it's super early, but I think this might be a contender. Anyway, uh, there's a lot of stuff dropping this month, so let's get right into it. First up, we have the women's Nike Air Max 187 Malicite on March 4th for 140 bucks. Then we have the Jordan Jumpman Jack. This is gonna be on March 5th for $200. And here's a gif of the Jumpman Jack spinning for as long as our editor can make it spin during this bit. I mean, what else is there to say? You're either excited for Travis Scott's first actual signature shoe with Jordan Brand, or you're not after seeing them being teased for what seems like years now. I I kind of wish everybody did something like this for every sneaker. It makes our job a little bit easier. Uh, we also have the Jacquemus Nike J Force One. This is gonna be on March 1st for 175. We have the Nike Dunk Low Light Bone and Bark Dark Stucco, not Bark Stucco, Dark Stucco on March 5th for 135. We have the Nike Dunk Low Waffle on March 5th for 125. We have the Dunk Low Next Nature in Tan on March 5th, and that one's gonna cost 130. Then we have the Anta Kai One. This is the artist on court colorway. This is gonna be on March 6th for 125. So after months of speculation that Kyrie Irving's debut signature shoe with Anta could retail for around $200 to $300 with wider distribution than what we're used to seeing with other Anta shoes, Anta announced that the Kai one will launch at 125. And it's gonna be available at sneaker boutiques like Extra Butter, Sneaker Politics, and Nice Kicks. That's a sign that both parties are aligned in trying to make the Kai line successful here in the US. While we won't be seeing these sneakers at Foot Locker or JD Sports right away. Pricing them around the same level as the early Nike Kyries will attract a customer base that maybe were interested in that Dwayne Wade or other NBA stars who made the jump to a Chinese brand, but they just couldn't pull the trigger because they were priced as a premium product. Um, we have the women's Air Jordan 1 Retro High. This is the OG and Dusty Clay. That's gonna be on March 6th for 200 bucks. We have the Liverpool FC Nike Zoom LeBron Next Gen AMPD. This is on the 7th for 170. The Nike LeBron 4 Fruity Pebble on March 7th, and this is $250. So originally this was a player exclusive for LeBron James back in 2006. Uh, LeBron for Fruity Pebbles is getting quite the rollout as both regular and cleated editions are dropping on the same day. Once reserved for those just close to James inner circle, save for the occasional leaked pair that would go for thousands of dollars on the secondary market. The Fruity Pebbles was a crown jewel for LeBron sneaker collectors that can now be yours for hooping or blowing past a defensive back. It's totally up to you. So that's the Nike LeBron for. Uh, then we also have the Nike LeBron 4 Menace 3 cleats in the Fruity Pebbles colorway, and those are gonna be on the 7th for 220. We have the Nike Air Max 1 Volt Chile. This is gonna be on March 7th. The uh, Kiko Kostadinov, this is the A6 Gel Lock Roast. This is gonna be on the 7th for 195. We have the Adidas Yeezy Slide Dark Onyx on the 7th for $70. So Adidas is selling the remaining Yeezys that, ha that they have in stock, and Kanye is gonna call them corny, et cetera, et cetera. Totally up to you how you feel about that. Then we have the Cinnamon Toast Crunch Crocs uh, All-Terrain Clogs. This is gonna be on the 7th for 65 bucks. We have the Nike Dunk Low You Deserve Flowers. This is gonna be on March 8th for 115. See, I thought Nike finally figured it out and released all of the Valentine's Day sneakers ahead of Valentine's Day. Apparently that's not the case. Uh, we have the women's Nike React Pegasus Trail 4, give her flowers on March 8th, 140, same energy. These should have dropped February 8th, not March 8th. Come on, Nike, you, you can't keep doing this. Then we have the women's Nike Air Max 90 Futura, give her flowers, March 8th, $160. And then we have the Nike Dunk Low, give her flowers, March 8th, 115. Nikes, you just gotta do better. Come on, come on, do better. All right, then we have the kids, Nike Dunk Low, University Blue. This is on March 8th for 70 bucks. We have the women's Zoom Vimero 5 in blue gaze for March 8th, this is 180 bucks. The women's Nike Zoom Vimero 5 Photon Dust on March 8th for 160 bucks. Uh, then some of the premium stuff, we have the social status, Nike Mac Attack and Summit White. This is a restock. Those are gonna be on the 8th for 140 bucks. For you Stussy fans out there, the Converse Chuck 70 Ox and Poppy Red drops on the 8th for $100. Then they also have uh, a 70 High, and that's gonna be in sky blue on the 8th for 110 bucks. And then probably one of the top sneakers of the moment, the Adidas AE1 Velocity Blue. This is gonna be on March 8th for 120. And I just love these. I just wish they didn't break out the monochromatic look with the green Adidas Mountain logo on the heel. I don't know about the logo. Anyway, uh, we also have the Nike Air Max 186 Museum Masterpiece. This is gonna be on the 9th for 170 bucks. So the next Nike Air Max with the original air bubble design is an homage to the creator of the shoe, Tinker Hatfield. With its marbled upper that makes the sneaker a museum quality piece, the shoe includes the message, please don't step on the art on the insole and a short thanks to the man himself. 
Tinker Hatfield. Uh, we have the Women's Air Jordan 4 sale on March 9th for 200 bucks. We have the Marcus Smart Puma All Pro Nitro. This is on the 10th for 140. No, Marcus Smart didn't get traded to the Mavericks. This one is actually a tie-in to Smart's Young Game Changer Foundation. So I know you guys are excited, but don't get too excited. Um, yeah, and I think that's that's really everything for this week. A short list this week. Uh, but I got some pretty good stuff in there, some pretty good stuff. Anyway, as always, uh, make sure you like, favorite, and subscribe. Make sure you stay tuned for all the unboxings and all those sorts of things that happen here on this channel. I am Jacques Slade. As always, I appreciate you, and uh, I'll see you next week with the list of all the greatest kicks that are dropping that week. But then there's going to be the unboxing stuff that's happening. There's just a lot of stuff coming on the channel. Make sure you pay attention. All right, y'all. I'm out. Peace.